Hello and welcome! My name is Jehoram, this is my Let's Play series of oh, Europa Nazalis 4, where we are playing as the Blessed Nation of Ethiopia. And we kind of need to get back on track here. We, um, we haven't had the greatest few sessions behind us, so uh, we just lost our only really valuable ally in QQ because Ataman decided to take advantage of him and well, his misfortune as well and yeah we do have a stronger army than Mamluks but he has lots of allies and Iraq and Hejaz are strong enough that I don't think I can take them all on all of them so instead I think I'm gonna seek uh, some conquest here in Africa now uh, we have plenty of points to start uh, putting into it so um, I think as soon as these uh, Mamluk clans uh, have risen up, sorry, we are gonna uh, we're gonna go down here and go to war with Adjuran. So uh, let's just wait for that. Conversion done. Oh, we should probably do, uh, let's say, one year and then we do it. Get admin tech. Oh no, not, not, not one year, right away. Bam, done. And we're still one year behind. But we can now pass the acts of uniformity, yay! And you're at 90%, which means you can fire soon. Want to shock tree general there, which he is. And we're still losing money. Even with all this nice gold. Uh, let's see. The gold mine is here. Let's develop that a couple times. So you can raise our income a little bit. What is the unrest in this province? Uh, I don't want to risk uprising here, so I'm not gonna decrease autonomy. Uh, it wasn't quite enough, but enough that we probably. What are you doing? Did, did we. Oh, we lo lost our. Explorer. Well, we'll have to get a new one. Still lots of exploration to be done. Why do we have three colonies? That explains why we have no money. Uh, I do not know why we have three. I must have. Can't remember if that's on purpose, uh, but it's definitely expensive. And there it goes. Actually, rose up in the province we were in. Couple of conversions done. So we can now walk you down here and then we're just gonna go to half maintenance while we do that and we can now actually make money I like making money I would like to at some point buy some cannons for example and what do we have here? Ooh. Transports. Did we lose a leader? Yeah, we lost the leader as well. Yay. Uh, probably pay for one, even though we have 
pretty shitty our magician. Could we? We could get a general here. We can also demand military points. So let's do that. Uh, grant a general and then demand military points. Can we do this here as well? I must have forgotten this. Um, so we have to make a donation to them to get admin points. So we wait a little bit with that. And there's still some years before that. So I think we wait a little bit before we gain the admin points. Um, do we still have huge loans? No, we do not have loans. So we just have to earn enough money that we can pay them. Or at least get them to... So this is 20 loyalty. If we get them to 50, it might be okay to just make them mad for a little bit. That will probably be cheaper than giving them 90 ducats, to be honest. So why don't you two not merge? Merge, goddammit, merge! Okay, so... Are we ready for war at this point? Um, so this one just marches towards the capital and this one starts taking stuff. Uh, there's only one, only one fort in their land, so I think, I think he marches towards this. He spreads out a little bit and takes some land up here. And then we get, yeah, we take this and then we march on the, towards that, yeah. Yeah, that's the way we do it. And we need to take money from this guy. Um... So what, he has 10 transports, we don't have enough galleys to fight that, so we just keep our army, let's move our navy up here where it's, there's no chance he'll actually get to, and force it out. So, uh, we get a general here, ooh, that was a really nice one. Actually, let's put that one... Yeah, let's have the Siege General there and the Fighting General. Um, okay, let's declare this war. Let's just take a Holy War, because that means we can take everything for cheap. Um, Okay, and now we need you to go and explore something in in the other side of the world where we don't uh, need to worry about his navy. Oh, it's colonies, the last three. So please fill in each one of these colonies. Okay, so... That was nice. I'm even sp still fighting in speed five or st speed four. Let's go this way. It's a bit faster. Wonder where he's going.
And then we just take provinces and loot with this guy for a while. And now we go down and... I think this guy goes here. And you do this. Uh, so Im Habana. Or is it in in Habana? Yeah, lower taxes. So what do we want? Um, possibly all of it? This seems like a pretty good deal. But I do want to see if I can get his money first. Um, since money is nice. So, let's take any looters in this country to be gotten. Oh, Aitesh died. That's not nice. That means we could actually end up with a Regency Council now. I would not like that. Um, Proof relations. Could we right now? Oh, uh, call you back. Ooh, you need to get up there ASAP. Okay, we need all of your money, and you need you to pay some money to us. And you go up here, and that was unfortunate. Take your money. And all of your land. So let's see here. This one we definitely increase. Um, yeah, this one we do as well. This one has pretty city development. Yeah, I think we keep this. So, race development and some of it. Hold well, on, we need to keep more maintenance up. Okay. 
And I wanted to buy something. I wanted to buy some points. But do I actually? Yeah, we might as well when we have the money. Uh, we buy that, we get that, and then we see if we can give them something. Uh, to take them to 75. I have to give them quite a lot actually. Nah, I think we just take the 100 points. I don't want to be giving them a lot of land. Um, I don't think they will. Might be nice for the points, but it will definitely cost us a lot of money if we have to give them that much land. So we actually get did some 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 things. So now we just have to uh, deal with whatever uprisings we will have. Sunni zealots will rise up in Al Kaga or. So we need you to go up there as fast as possible. And we should probably raise maintenance on this. Yeah, that was good timing. I like how it says that we are under attack because it was a um, fort we we attacked into. So do we want morale? Yeah, I think we want morale. And fetishists will in the four. So once you're done there, you go to the four. Okay, um, is the opium particularist still in my... I feel like this is just double, double badness. Like, usually you will have natives, native uprisings in your colonies, and now you also get particularly, particularists. It seems like a bad... Bad double. Hopefully they will finish before that, but yeah, that seems really annoying. Um, anyway, let's increase this number to uh, let's increase it to 14 so we can move the four small fleet and get down there. A scattering of poison. The expedition was closing in on Korakoa when a barrage of arrows shot from the natives standing on the inviting beach assailed the ship. In the hurry to race away from the enemy who leapt with great whoops towards the canoes, the crew had to abandon some of the men who had been shot and tumbled overboard. When they had laid some sea miles between Korakoa and themselves, they discovered that the whole starboard side of the ship were covered in arrows. The explorer on board the sail ship was seriously wounded. The arrow that hit him had been poisoned. He lay in fever, sweating and swearing for several days. Despite the surgeon's care and his face made of urine olive oil, he died some time ago. So we just slot another explorer or what? Yeah, that's nice. That's beautiful. Didn't we didn't need that at all, and we didn't just pay for him like seconds ago. So now you're mad. For how long? Well, only for a year, so that's okay. But we can now demand diplomatic support. Which means we should probably use some diplomatic points. So are we still... Yeah, let's increase this mine even more. 
Uh, like this, I think. And yeah, now we're making quite a lot from gold. And then we go and say, Grand Monopoly Chargers. Um, Grand Admiral. Why can't we grab a... So he's at 60. So we can get to... We can get to 78, but do we want that? Uh, no, I think we just go take the 100. I think that's... I think we'll just have to live with that. 100 points is good enough. Anyway, I think I'm going to end this episode here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you didn't, continue to like, button, subscribing. Hope to see you next time. Until then, have a good day.